As the partial government shutdown continues, local businesses have been offering help to federal workers in the form of food. Tanya's reporter Mimi Alcala is at Lindbergh Field, where San Diego's Hyatt hotels are serving up hot meals to TSA agents all day. Employees from different Hyatt hotels are all here at the USO building, which is right across from Terminal 2, serving breakfast, lunch, and dinner to TSA workers here. And the TSA workers that we spoke to say they really appreciate this during the difficult time. What do we got here? Egg and cheese or chorizo? Oh, chorizo, definitely. It's just amazing the people that have come forward and offered us help. Hi, good morning. Up until a couple days ago, we weren't allowed to accept anything. Hi, how you doing? Good morning. Ron Gerber is a lead transportation security officer here at San Diego International Airport. <laughs> As he enjoys a quick bite to eat, the government shutdown is still weighing heavily on his mind. I had a good friend quit two days ago with one day's notice, and she said, I can't afford childcare. Gerber says he's also facing financial hardships, now having to dip into his savings account just to get by. You know, you just start cutting back. You know, you don't eat out. You know, you want a pizza? No, you don't do that. It's something TSA agents across the nation are dealing with, working without pay for several weeks with no clear end in sight. It's a tough time right now, and uh, these individuals are the ones that keep us safe. That's why the Hyatt Hotels of San Diego decided to come together and show their support. Egg and cheese or chorizo? All day, they're serving up hot meals to TSA agents, air traffic controllers, and Customs and Border Protection officers at Lindbergh Field. On Wednesday, the TSA screened 1.79 million passengers nationwide. Overall, 99.9% .9 of those passengers waited less than 30 minutes. 95.4% waited less than 15 minutes. And those who went through the TSA pre-check lanes waited under 10 minutes on average. Looking around, uh, you, you would never even tell that these individuals are affected by the government shutdown. For now, it's bacon and egg burritos <laughs> as the agents wait to see when they can finally bring home the bacon. Definitely appreciate it. it it's, it's just amazing that they stepped up to do that. San Diego is an amazing place. San Diegans are amazing people. And lunch will end at 1 o'clock this afternoon. Dinner will be served from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. And those with the Hyatt Hotel say they really hope that this encourages others to pitch in and help as well. Reporting from Lindbergh Field, Mimi Alcala, 10 News.